Okay, here's part two where they get into voting machines. Let's give my pillow Mike some credit. He showed up, was in adverse conditions, and he made his points. You'll see what I'm saying. And Jimmy Kimmel is a comedic genius. He took his shots and they landed hard. <laughs> Have a listen. Confident that you can win? Yeah, absolutely. A lot of them are going, do you think you can win? Do you think you win? Of course I'm gonna win. Mike, some of the polls show you winning this. Oh yeah, yeah, they all do. Now Mike, the poll actually did show you as the favorite, right? The Rasmussen poll. That's correct, yep. And then this happened. Mike Lindell received four votes. Carmeet <laughs> Dillon received 51 votes. And Ronna McDaniel received 111 votes. Now, does this seem like an indication that maybe your barometer when it comes to voting is off? You know, what it seems like, Jimmy, is that the RNC did, that their representatives didn't listen to the people of our country that wanted a change in the RNC leadership because I was the top of all the polls. I almost doubled both of them combined in the Rasmussen report, which came out last Thursday, the day before the vote. So, they, you know, I didn't realize that they, uh, you know, that they would, I would think that they would have went with what the people wanted because they represent the people. Do you believe this was a rigged election, too? No, absolutely not, Jimmy, because there was no machines involved. It was paper ballots and counted. Right. Okay, so um, you lost. You would have lost either way, I guess is what you're saying. Well, I don't know if I'd have machines. Like somebody could have filled with the numbers, right? You distrust machines. Um, does that is can does that extend to like sewing machines? Uh, yeah. Tell me, like, are, what about ice machines? You okay with those? Jimmy, I, you know what? I'm okay. You know, you can you can make fun of that, but we know the machines I'm talking about are voting machines, computers used in elections because we want to have elections and not selections. So not like the George Foreman lean mean grilling machine would not.